Here's your Farm and Ranch report from the Montana Ag Network. Welcome back for our Farm and Ranch news. As the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service seeks to rescind critical habitat regulations finalized in the last days of the Trump administration, outdoorsmen, farmers, ranchers, and other groups are alarmed at the news. Back in December 2020, Fish and Wildlife Service issued a final rule that revised the process for considering critical habitat exclusions under the Endangered Species Act. Now under the Biden administration, FWS reevaluated the rule and concluded the conservation purposes of the ESA are better met by resuming its previous approach. The proposal follows an executive order which directed all federal agencies to review and address agency actions to ensure consistency with Biden administration objectives. The American Farm Bureau Federation calls the effort a disappointment. Farm Bureau President Zippy Duval says the Biden administration has proposed three different changes to these regulations, signaling a return to complicated and burdensome rules that do little to advance conservation goals. Duval added that Farm Bureau will remain engaged on endangered species issues and encouraged farmers and ranchers to share their stories during the proposed rule change comment period. In other headlines, U.S. Senator John Tester on Wednesday announced he secured $1.5 million in USDA funding for four Montana organizations to teach and train farmers and ranchers through the Beginning Farmer and Rancher Development Program. The funding will go to the following. Bar 88 Enterprises in Innes, Community Food and Agriculture Coalition in Missoula, National Center for Appropriate Technology in Butte, and Stonechild College in Box Elder. Tester said this funding will ensure that new farmers and ranchers in the Treasure State have the resources and education that they need to succeed in the evolving world of agriculture and continue to keep one of Montana's greatest traditions strong for generations to come. We'll be right back. 